And let's go to Proverbs chapter 6, verses 16 through 19. To the left is the King James Version. To the right is the Expanded Bible. Okay. These six things doth the Lord hate. <clears throat> Yea, seven are in abomination unto him. 17. A proud look. So what is a proud look? So pretty much prideful, haughty. Let's look up the word haughty. Some people may not know what that means. Even I. Arrogantly superior and disdainful. So you look down on people, hey, I am better than you. No, that is wrong. A lying tongue, a person that lies. And hands that shed innocent blood. So, a person that murders. Murdering innocent people. 18. And heart that deviseth wicked imaginations. So, you are a person that thinks evil. Like, your thoughts are always, perhaps not always, but you are thinking about evil things, contemplating on them. I know that at times demons are going to place things into your thoughts, but you have the choice to take that thought out of your mind or to contemplate on that thought. And a person may say, well, Kevin, you know, I can't control my thoughts. Okay, what if eating a person's flesh came to your mind? You would quickly change your thoughts. <laughs> so, you have the ability to change your thoughts. Okay. 19, no, 18. So in heart that deviseth wicked imaginations, feet that be swift in running to mischief. What is mischief? Mischief. <laughs> Playing misbehavior or troublemaking, especially in children. So you are the type of person causing problems making it tough on other people, frustrating people, mischief. Okay. 19. A false witness that speaketh lies. So in this passage, speaking lies is pretty much in here twice. Verse 19 and verse 17. A lying tongue is a person who is lying. And in verse 19, a false witness that speaketh lies. So God does not like <laughs> liars, <laughs> my Lord. And he that soweth discord among brethren. So you are the type of person that's causing all types of trouble. God is not with that. He does not like that. So these things are in abomination to God. So reframe from them. I pray that this makes sense. God bless.